Good morning to you, meteorologist Amanda Pappas here, breaking down the tropics and keeping you informed, prepared, and connected on an area of interest that we have our eyes on. So X marks the spot of where we're watching. This is an area of broad low pressure, so it's got some spin to it, and we do see some more thunderstorms associated with it. That means that it's strengthening a little bit. That line right here, number two, that's going to be the direction it travels to the west and northwest. As it approaches the Bahamas, that's when we get to the shaded region. Inside this shaded region is where we could see that 60% start on up, and we could see this system become a tropical system, essentially. A tropical depression, potentially, by the end of this week into the weekend. So, as it moves towards the Bahamas, we need to get rid of this hair and dust so that way it strengthens, which looks like it comes to fruition right around Friday. So there are two scenarios. We can see the European come to fruition, which would mean the system would strengthen and then continue to ride on up eastward towards the coast, right? If that's to happen and this system does strengthen, that means our rain chances will be lower as the system will stay far east of the state. However, if the other hand, the American model comes to fruition, it would be weaker and just drag in a ton of moisture to our atmosphere and that would mean larger rain chances for us. So back and forth on the rain chances for Sunday into Monday, but just know the tropics will be impacting us locally here coming up.